I hope we all want to be as safe as possible when we ride. Whether we're just looking out for ourselves or we have a whole family of riders to consider, safety should always be priority number one. One of the easiest ways to be safer is to make yourself more visible. Being seen has always been the most basic and effective way to avoid issues, not just while snowmobiling, but while participating in any recreational activity. But how can you increase your visibility without putting a whole bunch of awful looking lights all over your snowmobile? Well, CKX has the answer with their new 2022 Ungava lighted jacket. Now I had to look up what Ungava meant. Turns out it's a far northern peninsula in the province of Quebec, Canada. Since I haven't had any actual hands-on experience with this jacket, I also had to look up someone who has and who could tell us more about it. Luckily for me, one of my best friends is a CKX brand ambassador and has first-hand experience with the Ungava lighted jacket. You were actually part of uh, a video shoot with CKX for this specific jacket. Tell me a little bit about the Ungava jacket. Forget about the light. Just tell me about the jacket itself. Is it actually a good snowmobile jacket? Yeah, so it's it's, it's really comfortable to wear. Um, it's a fully insulated jacket. Uh, so it, it is really warm. On um, the days that we were shooting, it was pretty cold outside, but fully wind resistant. I wasn't cold at all. Um, I, I really like the, the design of it. It's simple yet still stylish. Uh, the graphics on it um, with, with the cool CKX logo pr predominantly on, on the jacket. Um, and it comes in three different colors. There's the orange, the gray, and the uh, high vis green. Um, so you do get some options there. Did you get a chance to test the lighting feature and how did it work? Yeah, so when we were out riding, like I said, we were riding during the day. We also did some shooting at night with it. And I found that it worked really well in, in all three. Um, obviously at night is when you see it sure. the most, uh, but even during the day, like if you're out going down the lake and there's, you know, lots of snow dust and, you know, there's a few guys up ahead of you, you can't see the tail light on the snowmobile, but you can see the, the red jacket, uh, the red light on the jacket, no problem. So you know exactly where, where your buddies are up ahead. And um, so yeah, the light feature works really well in, in that respect. Could you feel the light strip or the wires of the battery pack while you're wearing the jacket at all? No, no, you obviously the light strip, you, yeah, you don't know, you can't, doesn't feel any different on your back. Um, the only thing is, is the battery pack does go inside the inside pocket of, of your jacket. Um, so you might feel it a little bit like something's in your pocket, but it would be the same as like having a cell phone or a wallet. What are your thoughts on auxiliary lighting other than just a taillight? If you do a lot of night riding, I would highly recommend that jacket for sure. Just because the more visibility I think is, is better, mm -hmm. um, especially at night because visibility is reduced. Mm -hmm. um, so that, that jacket does offer that just from a pure safety standpoint. Um, I think CKX did a really good job at, at uh, you know, coming out with that unique feature because there's really not a whole lot of other options as far as a light integrated into a snowmobile jacket. Thanks for coming out and answering our questions yeah, for us. Appreciate anytime. it. All right. Yeah. I think the Ungava lighted jacket with its high mounted LED light strip is a fantastic idea and I think it will make you the rider safer. But what if you have different gear or you want to go one step further? Well, it's Bite Harder who has the solution for that. Their helmet safety light is a simple product that takes visibility to another level for a couple important reasons. First, it's mounted at the highest point, your head. Typically your head deals with the least amount of snow dust, so a light mounted there will be the most visible, but your head is also constantly moving. So when it's lighted, it'll attract a ton of attention. The second reason the Bite Harder helmet safety light takes visibility to another level is that the light itself is offered in multiple colors red, amber, green, blue, and pink. This makes it possible to color code your lights on a group ride or use different colors to identify different riders in a group, which is especially effective for families. Let's say dad typically leads the group. Give him the green light. That way everybody in the group will always know where the leader is. Let's say mom's typically the sweep. Give her the red light. This will grab the attention of riders approaching from the rear. Give brother the blue light and sister the pink one. Now mom and dad always know where their kids are, even at night, and especially when the snow dust is bad. The Bite Harder Helmet Safety Light installs onto any helmet with simple double-sided tape. It's powered by your sled's 12-volt accessory outlet, and it includes a junction box that allows you to power both the light 
and your heated shield with one cord. In my opinion, the ultimate setup would be the CKX Ungava jacket and the Bite Harder helmet safety light. This would offer the ultimate invisibility at multiple height levels. If you list safety at the very top of your priority list when you ride, being visible should be a high priority consideration and these two products make being more visible both simple and stylish.